is because of the blood of Jesus. When we are worshipping the true living God. Say it's because of the blood of Jesus. When I know the true living God. It's because of the blood of Jesus Christ. Build restoration service for world peace by Jesus Christ. Yeshua. When you are saying Yeshua, you can lift up your hands. Ah, Yeshua. Ah, Yeshua. Ah, it's Jesus. It's Jesus. It's Jesus. It's Jesus. It's Jesus. It's Jesus. He is the owner of this service. You see now, when you are lifting up your hands. Hallelujah. Let us read the word of God. Open your Bibles from the book of Revelation, chapter 1. We shall read verse 5. Then we will read other, other verses in the scriptures for references. But this is our key scripture. Under this topic which says is because of the blood of Jesus. When you see us here in this place is because of the blood. Not the blood of the animals not the blood of the chickens, but the blood of Jesus Christ, who is the Son of God. This blood of Jesus Christ worked many things here on earth. And the works of this blood of Jesus Christ cover all people, all countries, and all continents. The works of the blood of Jesus Christ cover all 
countries and continents. As we are here, we are in the continent of Africa. Christ Jesus already revealed to us about the seven continents which are making the world, the earth. But all those continents were stolen by the devil. As the devil is a thief, he steals. But we thank God because the blood of Jesus restored all all the continents. The power from the blood of Jesus Christ. This power from the blood of Jesus removed all the heavy chains from the darkness kingdom for a human being to be saved is because of the blood. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Remember all the songs which are talking about the blood of Jesus Christ. Revelation chapter 1, verse 5, it says, and from Jesus Christ, the faithful witness, the firstborn from the dead, and the ruler over the kings of the earth to him who loved us and washed us from our sins in his own blood. Openbaring hoofstuk 1 ons lees versie 5 and that word so gelees and van Jesus Christus die betrouwbare getuie Die eerste wat uit die dood opgestaan, het van Heers oor die konings van die aarde. Aan hom wat ons lief het en ons dierse bloed van ons sonders verlos het. Amen. Limo go Jesu Christe, jo iling ene moesupi, jo ikanye gang, wa moetswa la pele wa baaswi, limo laudi wa di kosi tale fati, ena jo ori ratang, Praise the Lord. The first thing which I want you to underline there, which is very special, very special. The belangrijkste thing that I will learn, you must track line that honor. The last sentence. Carlo ya bufelo. The last son says. Yeah. In his own blood. Mama ding ailing aha hue. And say a ye blood. In his own blood. Mama ding ailing aha hue. And say a ye blood. He washed us. Or it has we say. He redeemed us. Aribusetsa. Had for us for loss. He removed sins from us. Atrosasibi kwa korona. Using what? Adirisa e. What did he break? Not using somebody's blood. Asadirisa madi amungu hel. Not using the blood of the animal. Asadirisa madi adi pol adi pol for. Jesus Christ didn't ask other blood from people or from the animal. Jesus Christ said, The Bible says, the Bible says in, his in his own blood. Can you put yourself in? Because really he did the work by his own blood. Put yourself in. Put yourself in, in the blood of Jesus Christ. This is what Jesus Christ did. When he is washing the whole world, all continents, all countries, all generations, all tribes and clans. All 
He called them all to his own blood. Clap hands for this. Clap hands for this. Clap hands for this. He called He called a group to where? To his own blood. Then he washed us by his own blood. What are you learning? You will see the deception in the darkness kingdom. The darkness, the devil, Satan, the devil, doesn't call people to his own blood. This is what he does. He sent the people this is the devil. That is devil. to go and research the blood and go and drink the blood and drink thy blood some are washing with the blood learn this deception also it's the people who are visiting the witch doctors when you arrive there the witch doctor is not going to use his own blood. He will cut your body. Are you seeing that they don't have the grace? They cut your blood. They cut your body for your blood to come out. But look at the king of kings, Jesus Christ. He called the whole world. He called everyone to his own blood. And he washes the whole world by his own blood. Clap hands for him. Say it. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. The good example. You see, when you are flowing with the Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit will bring also the examples for people to understand. Another example, which I'm receiving now, here, here. Glory no, no. no. to Jesus, guys. Another example. Another four bells. Look now. Also the witch doctors. Lady Sango. When they say they want to remove the bed legs from you. Which is not the truth. Because which is not the truth. Is then that they are putting more bed legs into your life. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. The example which I have received when I'm here. here, here, here. So, I didn't come with it. I'm receiving many things. Before, 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 before. The witch doctor. The sango. The two doctors. If he or she says, ha, e, e, na, you need to be bathed by the blood of chicken. He or she the is blue. not going to give you his own chicken from his family. They will say, go and buy. They send you away. They send you away. They say bring. Because they are not the true shepherd. It's because of his blood. Also, when we are listening this message, I'm enjoying the word of God. I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying the word from the word. From the Holy Spirit. Did they give you basella of their own chicken? 
When you have visited them, yeah. did they give you their goats there for you to be bathed? They will tell you to go and buy or to go and search. It shows you that they don't have ownership. They are not the owner of the life. But Jesus Christ is the author of life. He gives life. You see, when he is giving life, he doesn't say, hey, I will run short. Hey, go and search. No. Also, when he blesses, there is no overdose in blessings. Here, Jesus Christ is teaching you many things in the spiritual world. We learn that there is no overdose in blessings. No overdose in the word of God. No overdose in prayer. No overdose in worship. Hey, no overdose in whatever you are doing for God. Why? He is the author of life. It's because of the blood of Jesus. When now the earth is the is knowing about the true living God. It's because of the blood of Jesus Christ. When all people they are knowing now to worship the true God. People are coming from God's some gods were being kicked by their feet. Some gods were failing even to stand. Some gods are there, where in the graves. But because of the blood of Jesus, which was shed, the whole world is covered by this blood. And the whole world is having testimony about the blood of Jesus. Christ. That is why. Now you go. and me, we are together today. Again, that is why we have churches all over around the world. Is because of the blood. blood from Jesus Christ. When now, no, the people are able to worship the true living God. When we read about what happened to Abraham, when God from Abraham, coming from the family, from the family, which was worshiping the idols, but the idols, but God called Abraham. To leave his family and say, family to lost. And he followed the living God. And for the living Let me tell you, me and you, we were not going to know the living God if Jesus Christ didn't come. It was tough. Let me tell you, it was tough. It was going to be tough for us to know because you see, every nation. The nations were having their gods, and you find that every nation is boosting about the gods. There were competitions about the gods. There was competition the I have seen that also when we were in Turkey. 
Pastor had a we saw this with our eyes, real eyes. The gods which the people were worshipping also by the time of Apostle Paul. Made by the stones. Different colors of stones. Big ones, giant ones. And again, we saw this with our eyes. In the shops and right on the free markets. When people are selling goods like tomatoes, veggies of South Africa. It's not true. Pastor, it is not true. They put the tables here, they put the different colors of gods. Made by different colors of stone. You will see the queue of people. Not African people from Africa. People from there. Men self and I play. You see them on the queue. Walking like this. What did they call? And they choose. And they kiss. Maybe by by cartel. Then they pay. Ba, they put batal. it in the plastic bag. Where in the sack and batal. Ba patel, ba 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 sanya mo mo plasticy. I'm telling you, this is what I did. That is what he let do. I went to, to another lady who was buying the goods. Then I said, "What do you want to do with this?" And Pastor at Kafra, what will you make me do? She said, "English there is very tough." But at least by the grace, she answered me. She said, ah, don't you know God so and so? And to say for pastor, then I said, for what? For what? For what? For, what? Ah, for protection of the house. Um, from self to be scared and the house. It was not going to be possible for you. To know the living God. If Jesus Christ didn't shed as Jesus Christ needs a blood to deal it. Amen. Say amen. amen. Say it's because of the blood of Jesus. When I know the true living God is because of the blood of Jesus Christ. When I say Jesus, it's because of the blood of Jesus Christ. When I say Amen, Amen. to say Amen is because of the blood. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Say amen. 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 It's because of the blood. Amen. Amen. You were not going to say amen. You were going to say many things. Let us continue. Hey. Everybody say hey. Point number one hey. says. Yes, the point, sir. When we are worshipping the true living God, it's because of the blood of Jesus. When we are worshipping now the true living God, otherwise, hey, we will be still being controlled by the deceptions. But the deception now is removed. You who are not yet saved, not yet born again. Remember before you received Jesus Christ, you were living in fear. There were things which were making you to be scared. But once you are saved, 
You live by the name of Jesus. Because of the blood which was shed for you. Hallelujah. You are no longer putting things in your pocket. It's a sign of protection. So that element for your basket. Because the blood was shed already for you to be protected. And this is the blood of Jesus Christ. That is the blood from here. Everybody say the blood of Jesus Christ. 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 Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. You see, when somebody is deceived, you can feel for that person when uh, what the people are going to say. Hey, am I not going to die? Ah. As iman for your religie, they can then worry bang. I can't need do it now. What can I be? Motu khasi editswe uatsura. How is your awo? Shwa kosa hodi rakala e. When somebody doesn't know about the blood of Jesus Christ. Men can even the blood from Jesus. Christ. The, person, the person lives in fear. As you know that I'm always in the services of Jesus Christ. I see many things. I see many restorations. When you don't know the works of the blood of Jesus, you live by fear. If somebody points you with a finger and said, I will be with you, you get terrified. But when you have Jesus Christ, they can point you with the tails of jackalas, the tails of what? The tails of what? They can even bend and release the air for you. They will see you walking every day in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. They can try to call your name if they are witch doctors. When they want to destroy you, when they are calling your name, they are not going to see you there. They will see only fire representing you there. Blessed are those who are washed by the blood of Jesus. Because when they are washed by the blood of Jesus, they are no longer living in fear. You can sprinkle anything where I pass. I will come and pass. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hi, 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 hi. All plans from the darkness kingdom, the collapse. Jesus Christ says to me, Jesus Christ says, darkness will plan against you. He says to me, in all plans, darkness is not going to succeed. That is why if you are telling me something from darkness, you know, I'm just taking it as simple, you know. It's only that I have the heart of the pastor, of people, I have to listen. I listen to you then. Pastor, I long to come for you. Jesus Christ is helping you. Elke ian at the leister. Praise the Lord. Point number two. In Sayabu Beach. When we know that there is life after death. Asons vierda as lieve na di duat. Hari izu urhona lebo silo mo morau khalifu. It's because of the blood of Jesus Christ which was shed. That is there the blood from Jesus Christ as vat khadiya. Kika bagala madimur na Jesus as sulukhi. When now we know that there is life after death. Tan vietons das lieve na di duat. Kika mori izu urhona lebo silo mo morau khalifu. When we know that there is life after death, we know that death is defeated. Ons vierda altar na di duat as tar. Ra izu lifu lifu le khataki lo lifu le fence we. And death is under our feet. And the daughter is on her own foot. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Because of the blood of Jesus. My dear, the blood from Jesus Christ. We, know that we live even though we are passing from this world. Point number three, it says. It's because of the blood of Jesus. 
Das dir die Blut When we stand for the name of Jesus Christ in all seasons, as we stand for the name of Jesus Christ in all these seasons, we stand for this name. On stand for the name. And we stand by this name. And on stand lang the name. Why? Because the blood was shed. When the blood is shed. For us to live. So that us might live. So we know that when we have Jesus. Right. 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 So we know that when we have Jesus. Right. 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 Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Quickly, we are reading the scriptures now, all the reference scriptures. Then we go to worship. Revelation chapter 5, verse 9 and 10, it says, And they sang a new song, Saying, you are worthy to take the scroll and to open its seals for you were slain and have redeemed us to God by your blood. Out of every tribe and tongue and people and nation and have made us kings and priests to our God and we shall reign on the earth. Openbare hoofdstuk 5 versie 9 en 10, dat wordt so gelees. Toe sing hulle een nieuwe lied met die woorde. U is waardig genoeg om die boekrol te neem en sy seels te breek, omdat u geslag is en met u bloed mense vir God vry gekoop het uit elke geslag en taalgroep, volk en nasie. U het hulle vir ons tot konings en, priest, en priesters gemaakt. Praise the Lord. 1 Peter chapter 1 verse 19 Peter 1 1 verse 19 But with the precious blood of Christ as of a lamb without blemish and without spot We are redeemed by the blood of Jesus Christ the precious blood of the Lamb. This is the blood of Jesus Christ. That's the blood of Jesus Christ. So we are redeemed by this blood for us to live here on earth enjoying the name of Jesus and enjoying the power of God living in us enjoying the fellowship which we have with God we are redeemed by the blood the precious blood of the Lamb that is why we are here that is why we are here. It's because of the blood. The worship team. Worship team. Lift up your hands there. As you will be now. Committing yourself to the word which you have heard. I'm asking those who are not yet saved, born again. Do not miss this day. When you know that you don't have Jesus Christ in your heart, As if, this is your special day to receive him. That is your dark on for like Christ 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 Christ. Where you will mark on your diaries, on your calendars, mark in your diaries that the day I received Jesus Christ. The dark to a Jesus Christ is on fire. Thank 
door of your heart. Open for him. Open for him. He is speaking with your heart right now. I pray some of your heart. Open your blood. He is speaking with your heart. Jesus Christ has brought me your heart. Come and receive Jesus. Come on far, Jesus Christ. The church, as you know, when they are coming, we celebrate, we ululate. On the care, on the fear, on the mutlo. On the welcome, Ella. The fresh and new day from the hands of Jesus Christ. From Jesus Christ. Look at them when they're coming. Coming to receive the King. Devil is off. When I'm looking at you, I'm laughing. Right from, from my heart. Why? I understand very well. I understand. Say for stand by That today. That vandaag. After you have received Jesus. Jesus Christ is on far. Your life will be totally changed. Your life will be totally changed. Your life will be totally, totally. Your life can heal others. Yes. Lift up your hands. And up. Together with those who are watching through the screen of television, yeah. if you know that you are not yet born again, it's your time to be saved. Follow me in this prayer. Say, Lord Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus Christ. Today. I'm receiving you as my Lord and my Savior. Come into my heart and give me new life. I believe with my heart that you are the Son of God. And I confess with my mouth that you are Jesus, the Savior, the Son of God. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah.
שלום. שלום. You are welcome in the kingdom of God. You have been purchased by the blood of Jesus. This day is a special day. When you come at this time, the appointed time for your salvation, it is a special day when we remember yesterday when Jesus Christ was crucified. He died and he rose again. Yesterday, he died. We remember his death. That blood that was shed, it was shed for you. So you came at the right time. You have been redeemed at the right time. The power of the blood of Jesus Christ is working. It has worked for you. You are new in the name of Jesus. What has happened yesterday or a few minutes ago when you committed something wrong all those sins have been washed away by the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus Christ has been crying for your souls. The blood of Jesus when you were there in the world not knowing anything about Jesus that blood is continuing to cry for the rest of the world that are not in Jesus. So you are welcome in the kingdom of God. You are a brand new creation. You have been purchased by the blood of Jesus. This blood of Jesus Christ is a powerful blood. It's not the blood of animals. It is the blood of Jesus that has power over all darkness over all powers of darkness. So we thank God that you came to his altar today at this time the appointed time where your soul is now in the hands of Jesus. When you leave this place you are with Jesus. You are never alone. This Jesus will never leave you nor forsake you. Look at yourself. You are beautiful because of the blood of Jesus. You are brand new. You are no longer of the world. You now belong to the kingdom of God. Your names are now written in the book of life. From today, look at yourself. Thank the Lord Jesus that your name is no longer in the book of darkness or the books of darkness. There are many books but in the kingdom of God, there is only one book. The book of life. Your names are in the book of life. You are new from today. We thank God for you. We thank God for you. Now, you are going to look for a church. It is closer to your home. There are many churches or many centers that are under WRS. That WRS, that World, is Restoration Service. World Restoration Services. There are many pastors that are sitting there. Don't go and look for a wrong church. In this church, in the World Restoration Service Center, World Restoration Service Center. we don't give anybody anything. We are not going to give you water. We are not going to give you oil. We are not going to give you, going to give you ropes. We are only giving the, you the name of Jesus Christ. When you look at us, 
is because we have a name. We also have that name from today. The name of Jesus Christ. When you pray, you are not going to pray using any person's name. You are only going to pray in the name of Jesus Christ. So we have pastors. Many pastors that are here. Now you are going to meet the, these pastors. Wherever you are coming from. There's a center there. There are many, more than 70 centers. So wherever you are coming from, there is a center closer to your house. So we thank God for you. We bless the name of the Lord. Don't depart from this Jesus. Do not move to the left nor to the right. Just concentrate on the cross of Jesus. We are the true living church. We are the true living church. We are living in Christ Jesus. That is why we are called the children of God. Amen. Amen. Let's clap hands for them as we welcome them in the kingdom of God. You are washed by the blood of Jesus. You have been redeemed by the blood of Jesus. We are so happy. Can you clap hands for them? More are coming to the kingdom of God. More they are coming. Let's celebrate. Let's celebrate in the name of Jesus. So you are going to follow those uh, ushers on my right. You, you walk to them. You talk to the pastors. They will talk more to you about many things of the kingdom of God. Amen. Let's clap hands for them. Praise the Lord. There is power in the blood of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Build restoration service for world peace. By Jesus Christ. Listen to the history of the Khoisan Bushmen people. Ayo. Now, I'd like to present to you just a shortened version of the history. Uh, so that you can know where we as the Nkre people fit into the greater Sun community. So the word son is actually not a Bushman word. It's a koi koi word. Okay, it is not really clear what it means, but probably it means hunter-gatherers. In the late 1920s and 1930s, this, the word Khoisan was coined by a uh, uh, researcher, Leonard Scutcher. And it was promoted by an English-speaking uh, person in the uh, name of Isaac Shapira. Now, previously, uh, people or the, uh, the Bushmen people were called different names by other groups. So other language groups, they called the Bushmen Suakwa, Boshimane, Bushmen, Bushmen, Basarwa, Basarwa, Batwa, Batwa, Abatwa, Abatwa, Barua, Barua, and so forth. 
but the sun people the bushman people emba va sene ke va ma bushman they call themselves sasi vai pija ore ko na ma sasi that is for all the bushman people it's sasi kore va to va va bushman ka makana va na ba pija ore ke ma sasi but there were also different groups of people within sasi em ba be go na le di hlopa tše di fa 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 pa ne go mo gare ga hlopa so sa sasi uh there were uh, the the tramka tre ba tramka tre that is the bushman of the karu ke ma bushman akwa karu then you get the ngqe o humana ngqe there is us ke rena from the southern kalahari go tswa le gana tel la kalahari you get the tlegwe o ho ja ba tlegwe from the north uh, drakensberg go tswa le le bua la dithabeng ja drakensberg and there's a lot of other names that i can just now uh, uh, tell you about but there's not enough time go na le maina mantsha nga go botsang ka ona emba ka bakala nako nga se khonega so the ngqe people they are speaking ngu ya le ngqe people ba bolela ngu Actually there are three major language groups within the uh, Khoi and Sen communities. Abotso go na le maleme a magolo a mararo mo magareng ga makhoi se. And the Khoi languages you will get the uh, um the Khoi Khoi Khovap. Mo go le le mela makhoi o tla go tsa the Kwedam Khoi Kham. Ani Kwedam. Ana ka mkho. Khoi Khoi. Ana Kana and Naro. and naro uh um, in the the only surviving language under the 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 ta language lelimelele sa phela mo malemeng ao ka moka the ta language group mo lelimela matha is this language of ours ke lelimele lela nada kumke the new language the new language la gu so uh, what i'm trying to do is just explaining how we fit into the language groups of the uh, bushman people so ke le kang go le bontsha sona ko ra na re na re tsana bya mo le lemeng la ma bushman but most importantly is to 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 bring to you information about how critically endangered this language is emba se ke na kang go le bontsha sona e no ba go re na bo bo kotsi bya le lemeng le bo mo kae researchers has, and they came and did research on the language di banya kishije ba ile ba tla ba dira dinya kishijo ka malemele and they found that this language is more than or they estimated to be more than 25000 years old ba ile ba bona o le lemele o le na le mengwa ga e fetang 225000 years and it's probably the 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 oldest living language on earth ga bo tseke le lemele le ngore ke lona la khala 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 le le saleng gona le khone mo le faseng uh currently we only have four people in the world ga na be le rena le di hlopa tše nne fela mo le faseng who speaks this language fluently re bona la go le lemele ga botse tu katrina yesu is one of them tu katrina go mongwa bona there are only four left ke ba ba ne ba nnoshi ba shetjeo is tu katrina she is now 84 years old ke ku katrina wa ne o nemi wa ga masome se swa inne her sister is 86 years old ngwana a bona le mengwa ga 86 the other sister is 97 this year o mongwana bo bona ona le mengwa ga 97 wa go the brother is in the 70s ngwana bo bona ona le mengwa ga masome shupa so you see the people are old o gana go bona re batho ba ke wa khale khale and uh, we are trying to revive our language ya le re le ka go tsoshulusha le leme la rena you know in those times when and when we were our people were oppressed wa tse bana go nyela ya ge batho be ba sagateletswe they were not allowed to speak the language nje ba sa dumela go bolela le leme le there is a loving witness ya le hlatsi yo e bophelang ke mo they were beaten nje ba be tho ge ba bolela le leme la ga bona they said that your language is ugly njo ba re le mela ga bo lena le bifile the self esteem has been broken down jwa le ba thoma go boela fa se ba nyenye fa culture and the language has been ripped from them se tsho le le mela bona ba ile ba la mogwa now what we are trying to do the new generation jwa le rena ba moloko moso se re le kang go sidira to bring back to take back what the devil stole from us go re buše tše morago se o satana ru tšeditše go sona because in my belief 
God created different languages as he created different people. Because when he sat there and he looked at his people and the diversity of the people, he saw the beauty of it. And what we're trying to do is restore God's beauty. What he created. Oh, Ma started a school, a language school. We've got uh, approximately between 30 and 40 Oma, children. Oma, Oma started the school. Grandmother started the school. Oh, very cool. I work when I at Thomas School. So she's a teacher in profession. The Kim queen. Ma the queen. She Ma never saw the door of a school. Ma Hoshiki and Atomilin School, Asaka at the school, Asaka at the Nalabatila School. Very like Murutishikamanga. But we need support. We need support because currently we don't have any support. Although there is acknowledgement for our efforts. Uh, in 2014, April 27, she received uh, from the President Zuma the presidential order of the the order of the Baobab in silver. She also received from Pencil Pen South African Language Board. The reward for the most dedicated person in this decade. In, preser in preserving uh, such an endangered language. Last year, August, the Deputy Minister of Arts and Culture rejoiced Malbuda Fasi. Malbuda Fasi. Malbuda Fasi. She... Um, Honored Oma with the uh, um, with the award for loving uh, human heritage. And uh, so there is a lot of acknowledgement. But what we need, that is not really what we need. What we need is the support on ground level. Everything she does, she does it out of her pension. So she's got all the titles. She's the queen. She's the loving, loving human heritage. She's a most dedicated person. She's, she's a member of the order of the Baobab. But that doesn't mean anything for the language if there is not financial support at ground level. So we urge you to pray for us so that God can step in. Because God says he will open the, window, the windows of heaven. And everything belongs to God. So, so we, we, we trust that the floodgates of heaven will be opened. Because Pastor Irene came with a message from God. God said it's our time. Restoration is here. So we trust in the word of God. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Pastor Thank you for the time. Ayo. Ayo.
World Restoration Service for World Peace by Jesus Christ. I greet you in Jesus' name. Uh, My name is Sianda. Uh, I'm coming from Cockstad. Hallelujah. Uh, I think in the twins of Tetangayo Apa, in the Bana in the Sukapi, Utikun Tatepi. I'm going to tell you where the Lord found me. I mean, uh, I was 13 years old when I was initiated to be Sangoma. Amen. But the Lord delivered me from the Sangoma. There are many things that were happening there. When Pastor Irene was preaching, he touched on something that is very important. That when you come to us, we wouldn't give you what we have, but we will take things from you. Like chickens, if we need such. Yeah. Like when you come there, you're coming with uh, bad lucks. During that time when we were still in darkness, we, we will say, take a chicken, we are going to bath you with the blood of a chicken, then your things will be well. Uh, actually, because but at that time, in fact, we didn't know what we were doing because we were still in darkness. Exactly. Um, the other thing is that I went in the underworld or under the water. Uh, for three days. I was there for three days. Uh, there I was sent to go and, and get some uh, herbal medicines. And for three days, I was there for three days. I came from there with a bag. And this bag was given to me as a muti that I'm going to use. But actually, But all of those things, they faded away. When I met the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. In my encounter with Jesus, he changed my life drastically. Today I'm alive, I'm living under the blood of Jesus. I'm no longer living under the blood of chicken. I'm no longer living under the blood of cows. But under the blood of Jesus Christ. There were many sufferings I went through. At a home, we exhausted all the money because of this. I dropped out of school because of that. But when Jesus came, He restored everything that was lost. I can stand. Today, I can stand and say the Lord Jesus is alive. I have seen him in my life. And when I got ah, saved, they yeah. told me you are still going to go back because we know the ancestral spirits are strong and stubborn. 
and the Kumbula singing song on Masati. He has the Sianda, eh, Tanam Bay twelve Vele Watata, Zonkis into the Sess Golden Sako as the Sapa Nukinelli, Gobandias go to Sazo Ambo and Bopin to Boy. I remember one of the Sangomas came to me and said, Sianda, you should have taken all your stuff and brought it to under, under my care because I know that somewhere down the line we are still going to come back to these things. That since from 2013. But today, as of two, two, 2013, I'm still here. And I will be here. I will die under the hand of God. Praise Hallelujah. the Lord. Hey, Hallelujah. tell us about how they were teaching you to kill the cow. We use a long spear. We didn't use a knife. You must hold the spear as it is kinesthetic. And then they will hold the legs of the cow and stretch it. And then I will pierce the, the spear on the neck area there. I will pierce and the blood will ooze out. So they say if the, the cow did not make noise, then the ancestral spirits are not appreciating it. Which means we must buy another cow and ah! slaughter again. What will happen to the meat? Hey, what will happen? They will eat that one. Which by did... by each, of they, course. they eat ah! this one. Of course, they do eat the meat. Then I had you. They take the blood. And they put it in a five liter container. Around two in the morning. I will take that blood. And bath with it. And also some other moody stuff. Yeah, then... And then they will say it went very well like that. 2 a.m. in the morning. About 2 a.m. 2 a.m. When everyone is still asleep. And I will uh, wake up and go in that uh, around the house. And behind that. I will sleep alone in that because many people are still under initiation. They will sleep in that house. They run over. And behind it, when I get there, I'll be naked. Then I will bath and take the wash basin over my head and pour the water on me. After that, I wouldn't sleep. I will be sweeping the yard. In that house, they were using the cow dung to, yes. to put it there to decorate as, as a cement or something. Then I will be preparing food for everyone in the house. Because I will prepare food around six so that those who are working also there were four kids who were going to school four of them I must bath them even though their mother was there and even the abon who talking about eight is in we school in power nine in the arm and your teza and then around nine i'll be going to fetch some woods and then when I come and then I will make the fire and start cooking. Knowing that I only have a brief moment to take a rest and then I eat, but you don't eat anything. You, you only eat the white samp. Yes. Uh, and then on the chicken, you only eat the neck. Yes, pen. Then the rest is And then the rest is for the people here in the in that house. You don't eat the sweet stuff. You only eat that white samp and then the neck of a chicken. 
um jazz good to kin the abaparela and go on dick and I'm okay for um zozu can be out bango ya ukribe emva gom zozu kia treatwa. You must eat for one minute. Yes. If you take more than one minute, whatever is left, you must throw it away. They take the dish, they throw your foot away, and then they hide the dish away. They tell you then, after that, they'll be beating the drums. You, you must go and look for this dish. They will dance. They will dance. Then out the back trends are in Wolfnere. I think Gela Clashare La Pana, Ungenemoyen Wako, now Bumyama, Jemba Appas, Genemoyen Okai. During dancing, they will enter into that dark spirit. Then Gemaso trends are the air and a villa up and at the TV. Something will come up like a TV in front of you. A dish will come in your eyes. Then one be your tattoos each up as corner. So we'll, you will go to a fetch the dish. When you come back, you wash that dish. When you finish, hey, uh, that, those are other things. You can see that really Jesus Christ really removed this young man from deep, deep things. He said, what? They, they will dance in the dark room or in the, what? They will see something like what? Like a TV. It, it, it comes out of your eyes. Uh -huh. How big is the dish? No, a dish for eating, just a plate. Like a plate? Yeah. Okay. But a normal plate. A normal one? Yes. Okay, not the plastic one. No. So a dish will come up like a, like, like a film in the TV. Yeah. In your ah, eyes. Ah, we know. Uh, you can't tell Pastor Irene who knows darkness. <laughs> Jesus has already exposed many things from darkness. Oh, yes. Yeah. Something now is playing in the air, like TV. Jesus TV. Continue, Sian. Uh, when you finish all this, you go to your mother, the one who is initiating you. You will put water for you. You will wash your feet. And the father will come. You will wash the feet with the father. When you finish, when I'm finished, we'll go, I will go to the school and fetch the, 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 the students. There is no one who is helping me in, in this In other house. words, really, you can see that really he was a slave, this young man. But we thank God because after Jesus Christ restored him, he went back to the school. Why a school way? Yes. Amen. Yeah, and the funda, the funda Shipstini. I'm studying now at, at Shipsty. That's a course of travel and tourism. I'm doing a course called uh, traveling and tours. Amen. Um, Hallelujah. You see now, it's after after metric. Amen. Envago metric. Amen. After metric. The, okay. um, you, what are you learning? This young man, really. You can see that the young man was totally stolen. Amen. And look, if you look at him now, he's very clean even when you are looking at him. <laughs> He is still having many things because you have had some of the cruelty, waking up 2 a.m., bathing by the blood of the cow, killing the cow with the so it does. The There's another way of killing a, 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 a chicken. 
But in that initiation school, we were just uh, pulling it until it breaks. While it is alive, you just take the head and then you pull it and until you make it breaks. Sure, you, buy the chicken you have to make sure that the, the, the chicken is, it is, is breaking. Um, wow, such a cruelty. If you don't remove the head, which means you have to go and buy another one. Yes, Ipuma go Mali. You pay for another chicken. Yeah. I mean, I want to thank the Lord for all he has done in my life. Through this song that I love. Can I have a play? Jehovah Ritepile. Ritepile wena Jehovah Ritepile Ritepile wena Jehovah Ritepile wena Jehovah is happy Let me mourn and die Jehovah is happy Jehovah is happy Let Restoration Service for World Peace by Jesus Christ.